how are you doing? Um, I am back with more lipstick, lip gloss in this matter swatches. This is specifically the Too Faced Melted Matte, 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 Matte. Um, I got four of these, obviously, but they look really similar in shade right now. Um, it just way like it's here. Let me see if I can bring it up closer. They are somewhat similar to a certain extent why I just opened, but they are, um, you know, same, like, you know, the same color group, but the shades are different. Uh, once I swatch it, hopefully it should show up in the camera, obviously. Um, the room is slightly dark as well, so I'll blame it on that. Um, I am unfortunately not able to use a natural light, and I don't have a ring lighter anyways, and then my shadow's not helping either. There you go. That's a little bit better, I guess. So, let's start with the first watch. Let me see what the name is. Let me see, um, before I give the one name. This is particularly called Bottomless, if I can... I should be doing it more closely, I guess. So, this right here is bottomless. I feel like this video might be slightly short. I don't know why. But since it's matte, and um, normally a lot of the matte colors normally get on dry. You know how a lot of some of the lipsticks come off easily? So, since this is matte, this will definitely not come off that easily when you have on your lips while drinking eating stuff like that when it comes to the end i will try to see if you know i touch it and see if like you know how dry it is now this is called my type So that's what I was saying. Normally, the, these are the shades are different. So it, that's a good thing. Otherwise, I wouldn't really have it, have bought it. This is Queen B. See, now you get the swatches and you can tell it is different. Um, and last but not the least, um, this one is, hold on, I'm blind with this, Poppin' Corks. Okay, that is something for the first time I'm hearing, Poppin' Corks. Hold on. All right. Hold on, let me put that back so you guys can see properly with the last one. Um, this is how it looks like, all four of them. Um, I remember buying something similar to these. I have no idea what happened to those. Um, I don't know if somebody took it from me or it expired. But the, all the cases, I don't exactly remember. So now, touch test. Um, I think the... You know the extra layers, I think that's what it is, but other than that, the remaining was dry. Yeah, not that bad. Third one, there is a little bit of a blush, so I know that thing right there, so I know that's already not dry. So yeah, that actually came out. The wet part, but other than that, that's dry. Same thing with the last one. That area was not really dry, but... Hold on. The last one was wet. But the top three, 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 as you can tell, see, like right here, that one, um, it didn't dry, but obviously you wouldn't have any lumps, but for the most part, it is dry. Um, so, um, honestly speaking, I feel like this would be better than those lipsticks, um, where, you know, um, not, you know, those other, let me see if I can have one out. Okay, that was unexpected, my bad. Um, something like this, you know, um, these are easy to come off if you drink water, eat, or even if you're not doing anything, 
these kind of lipsticks will come off easily. I'm going to be doing swatches for these in a separate video. Um, so stay tuned for that. But, um, so I feel like these would be a lot better compared to the one I just showed you in terms of, like, it coming off. But other than that, I feel like these are pretty good, honestly. Um, I do like the shades. Um, I feel like they, they do pretty good. They do pretty good justice. I'm not gonna lie. Um, the colors are good. Um, now obviously I know not everybody will like these shades, which is completely fine. Hence why I actually did swatches for you guys. I know some people don't like these kind of shades. They want something more bright, which is com completely understandable. Um, this is why I'm doing the swatches so you guys can see what I have bought and what the colors are. Um, I'm not really the type of person that would wear black, purple, orange. I've seen orange lipsticks, so that's why I'm bringing it up. Um, I am kind of more on, obviously you can tell that more neutral-ish colors with the exception of like red, because I do wear red. Um, what else? Uh, what other colors I don't wear? Um... On a one extremely rare occasion, I saw somebody wearing green, but I haven't seen people often wear that. But black is something I wouldn't be able to wear because I can't pull it off. Um, purple, I know I can't pull it off. Not everybody can pull purple off. I know some people who can. But then I feel like it also depends on the shade of purple as well, I'm just guessing. Um, but I never was able to pull it off. Like those, re And then I know I'm for a fact that I don't like those, you know, very dark brown colors uh, for me in order for to wear the brown colors I will have to wear something that is extremely light neutral ish color and then put it so put it on to make that color a bit lighter um, I have mentioned those in the previous videos but other than that if you guys want me to do a review on something um, that I haven't done before on my video make sure to comment down below other than that I'll be linking down both my Instagram pages make sure to follow Hit the subscribe button, the bell button, and I'll be back for more. Stay safe and stay tuned, guys.